Happy New Year to all of my patients, all of my friends, and anybody else that's interested in cardio protection, living longer and better, not having side effects to medication, and Happy New Year to everyone that wants to do something that's very heart healthy for you moving into 2019 and beyond. I've been telling a lot of my patients about the cocktail, and I've said you should be on the cocktail. And who should be on the cocktail? And what is the cocktail? In my younger days, a cocktail was usually one type of gin or another and various other types of refreshments. But as we've gotten older, we realize you need a different type of cocktail to stay alive longer. You may have read that the American College of Cardiology came up with recommendations that so many Americans are not on statins that need to be on statins. What are statins? Statins are medicines that lower your cholesterol, plain and simple. Most of you may know that statins are used to lower cholesterol and that cholesterol and triglycerides are related together. And by having those numbers be low, it decreases your risk of having a heart attack or heart disease or developing vascular disease or clogging up your arteries. So what's the best thing to do for your heart? There are many things, and we could spend hours or days talking about them. Right now, for the purpose of this information little video, is I like to talk about statins and medications that optimize their value. We know that statins are life-saving and have saved millions of American lives so far. You may read in the literature that some people say never take a statin, that statins are harmful to you. And that may be true in a very small percentage of people. But millions of Americans are alive who are on statins, and they're alive because of the statin. They live longer and better. Figure I use regularly is if a thousand people need to be on a statin or have the indications of being on a statin, do how many people get benefit if they take it? And I maintain that 800 to 850 of those people will live 10 years longer, 10 better years with cleaner coronary arteries. I don't know if you can see the graph, but you want arteries that are clear. You don't want arteries that get plugged by plaque. Okay? The diagram can only show you so much. The arteries to the heart need to be clear if they're going to keep this great organ pumping away for life. We started having statins in our medical regime to treat people 30 years ago now. So we do know a lot about them and their long-term side effects. We've gotten better and better statins as time has gone on. We also noted some interesting things about statins, the aches and pains that occur with statins. We know that statins do cause muscle aches and pains, and the higher the dose you go up, the more the ache and pain. I figured out one of the remedies to the aches and pains. One of the things that we should remember is not to do a high dose if you don't have to do a high dose. And we've also learned who should be on a statin and who doesn't need to be on a statin. I've been telling you also to do a calcium score because that helps us divide the groups. Who needs a calcium score in your heart? Medium risk people need a calcium score. If you're someone less than age 35 or 40, you probably don't need a calcium score. If you're over age 40, if you're a man, or if you're over age 50, if you're a woman, and you have never had a heart attack or have known heart disease, you fall into the middle risk category, you benefit by a calcium score. A calcium score of zero, I don't know if you can see that, means maybe you don't need a statin at all, even if your cholesterol numbers are not good. A general rule, is if you're a woman with a score of zero and your cholesterol numbers are not so good, you have some time to negotiate and watch. But if you are a man and you have a calcium score of zero, but your cholesterol numbers are not good, how much time do you have? What do you do while you're waiting to develop heart disease? I tell everyone, if you have any calcium on your heart, that means we developed heart disease at least five years ago. So we're trying to get to the end of the game. The end of the game is way longer than we used to give ourselves credit for. Now, no one is satisfied with the average male age of 79. We want a little bit longer. We've discovered advanced lipid testing. We've discovered ways of making any number in the red move to the green zone. And with that success, and many people alive because of a statin, 
doctors have had to discuss the side effects of the statins. Before starting a statin, talk it over with your doctor. What should the dose be? And we also know that the potency of the statin and the type of statin is linked to certain side effects. So you don't want to take a statin if you don't need to, but you also need to take a statin in many different situations, and a statin may be what we need to adjust your lipid profile to perfection, so all your numbers are in the green zone. And this has been proven. This is not hearsay. You're right, we push so many drugs down patients. We give you too many pain pills, too many antibiotics. When you have a sore throat, medicines for your backache. We know that when we give people statins, we're trying to help them live longer and better. Here is what we're talking about. This cocktail, the famous cocktail, everyone has this sheet. There are four ingredients to the cocktail. One, two, three, four, okay? Well, I have said what you do with the cocktail. You mix these two things together. Cod liver oil and wheat germ oil, mix it together. Inside this little medicine cup, I'll show you exactly how we do it, okay? Because I want you to know. These are available. We can tell you more about that. Cod liver oil, this one is open. I should be here where they're not cutting me up. You do half a container of cod liver oil. And I'm running a little short. That's why I've got my next one ready, except they're sometimes tough to open. And half a container of wheat germ oil, a tablespoon and a tablespoon, 15 milliliters is 15 cc's, and you do them both together at the same time mixed in this container. We'll have to get a taller camera or a shorter doctor. Number three on the cocktail, cod liver oil, wheat germ oil, CoQ10. We're gonna chase it with CoQ10. Here's a CoQ10, okay? And this brand is supposedly the best. The people that sell this brand have said, go to the other store to get this brand. We have the CoQ10, okay? Everyone over the age of 70, was on cod liver oil when they were a child. Everyone that lived through the depression, everyone in the rest of the world from anywhere they came, from after World War I till after World War II, cod liver oil is how we survived and saved our lives and saved our brain. Both of these together in one container, right down the hatch, chased with a CoQ10, about a half a container. Maybe a little more, maybe a little less. The CoQ10 is actually good, it doesn't taste bad at all. That's the cocktail. You've done three quarters of the cocktail. To make the cocktail be right, you need the last part. You need to be on four omega-3. I may tell you, if you're an apple, you get four omega-3. If you're a pear, maybe you only get two. The studies have come out on omega-3. Proven, 25% reduction if you take Vesipa. Vesipa is brand name omega-3. They should give me a little stipend for advertising for them. They may be a little bit expensive. If your insurance covers it, it is proven to be the best product. If your insurance doesn't cover it and it costs too much, you can get Vitamin Shop brand, which is very good and very close, and that's what I take. EPA is what you want in your, in your omega-3. DHA is also an omega-3, and the neurologist and the ophthalmologist and orthopedic surgeon may like the DHEA a little more, but the EPA has been proven by the cardiologists in the studies they did to save lives, 25% reduction in heart attack and cardiac events. There you have the cocktail, okay? And we are giving you pages of information about what exactly it is, how exactly to do it, who came up with the cocktail, a very good researcher, out of UC San Diego, Dr. Beatrice Gollum came up with all that, she's the one that leads the statin side effect um, study. This has been going on now for 15 years. And she knows there are side effects to statins. And we have some different philosophies about some things, but the cocktail has been shown to do a few things. One, I've shown everybody a graph of this one patient. And I have multiple variations of a graph of a man whose numbers on the cocktail alone whose numbers on the cocktail improve. The cocktail will allow, if you don't take any cholesterol medicine, 
Your cocktail will make your cholesterol profile better. It will lower your triglycerides. It will raise your HDL without being on a statin. If you are on a statin, the cocktail will allow you to go to a lower dose of the statin for the same goal, or if you keep the dose of the statin the same, the cocktail will make your numbers be much better. I have this in pages and pages of proof. I have multiple people whose sheet without the cocktail is filled with red, and their sheets when they're on the cocktail, pardon me, are all in the green with nothing in the red zone. And this is not one patient or two patients. This is literally 100 patients that I've got the studies on and probably way more. So that in a nutshell is how the cocktail is. I know I talk too fast. You rattle through a bunch of information. You can play the video on slow-mo. You've got all the information in the handout. Just know cod liver oil, wheat germ oil mixed together in a little cup. Chase it with a CoQ10 and you deserve four omega a day. This will be good. Don't ask me why you can have grease and it lowers your triglyceride, but it happens all the time over and over. I know there are gonna be a lot of questions. That's what I'm here for is to answer your questions and give you help. I'm supposed to be your coach. I'm supposed to help you get to the get to overtime. That's what the game plan is. We're trying to get to overtime, including myself. And sometimes it's tough to get. You can order your supply for the cocktail in the link below. And you can get all the handouts on the link below. Thank you very much for being a great patient. I'm going to try and be a better doctor in 2019. And notice the phone did not go off once. It is not even hooked to me. I'm unhooked. Thank you very much.